Try to pull him out. What? Well, what happened? Where is Manning? Anybody mind if I ask who all you people are? <sighs> oh, yeah, sorry. I'm sorry. Everybody say hello to uh, Chief Wilson of the um, Mount Joy Police Department. Hello, Chief. Hank Gannon, District Attorney of Lantano County, Pennsylvania. I'm the man who put Todd Manning in prison in the first place. <sighs> And I'm this one's fiance. Are you sure you're warm enough under this little suit? Yeah, it's, it's amazing. Oh, and uh, excuse me, this is Marty Saybrook, unfortunately one of Todd Manning's first victims. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that, ma'am. Where is Todd? Well, at this time, we can only assume that he's dead. What about Rebecca Lewis? She came through okay, didn't she? Well, Rebecca wasn't uh, hurt. Not physically. Yes, ma'am. So you're not sure? Well, let's put it this way. It's way below freezing outside. The guy's got a gunshot wound. The river's like ice. We've been searching both sides of the banks for well over an hour, and there's no sign of him anywhere. There's no way this guy's still alive. That DA over there tells me that uh, you were one of Manning's victims. You might say that. Thanks to Todd, I don't think I'll ever really feel safe again. I don't care if they do find his body. I know, Marty. But it's over now. 
Mm-hmm. You heard what the chief said. There's no way Todd could have survived. It's all over, Marty. All over. After all the people. He's hurt. That's the way Powell, Nora, dealt with Rebecca. And you. It's never going to be all over. Not for me, not for any of us. Hey, Mary, if he comes back. Listen to me, he's not coming back. And even if he were, he, he, you certainly shouldn't be trying to help him. Trust me, I could talk to him. Have you forgotten everything he did? He raped Marty, he killed Swade. My God, Rebecca, he could have killed you. I knew a better side to him. I know, I know, I was there. You got through to him somehow, but I knew him too. And so did a lot of other people who he hurt. You didn't know him. I didn't know him at all. When they find him, and he goes back to jail, I'm going to stay by his side and make sure I can do everything I can to help him redeem his soul. Rebecca, he's dead. He isn't coming here, and he's not going back to prison. He's dead. You don't know... Must have been hell these past few days. No, oh, Dad! He could be alive! The cold water oh, Maybe it stopped him from bleeding. I've heard that happen sometimes. Rebecca, man, I'm mighty glad, glad to see you in one piece. Now, are you okay? I'm fine. Are you sure? Being Todd's prisoner. I don't think I could have stood. I, I, I would have killed him. Or myself. Good. You're all here. We've got some news. The divers downstream found Todd Manning. Well, is he okay? Is he alive? The divers found the body about five miles downriver. Are you sure it's Manning's body? Well, he took a hell of a trip down. He was, well, the body was pretty severely battered by all the ice and rocks along the banks. But the general physical description matches that of Todd Manning. There's just no doubt. Listen, Chief, I, um, I'd like to make arrangements to have the body transported back to Landview for positive ID. Oh, sure. State police will take care of all of that. Great. Thanks. Oh, and Chief, think it's possible that we could get some dry clothes for Mr. Buchanan here? Did you check and see what's out in the emergency vehicle? I just need a minute alone. I'll be all right. Listen, why don't we step outside and make our arrangements? I don't understand. How could you feel anything for him? Anything but hatred? that he did terrible things to you. But I did care about him very much. I knew he was the world's most convincing liar, but after all that time you spent with him, I would have thought you'd seen through it. I did. And I saw a lot more. He raped me. I know. 